Game on! Oh my gosh, how fun! Ooh, this is exciting. Please don't anger the birds. Angry birds. Angry birds. Here we are. <gasps> Look at the Monopoly. Hello friends and welcome to The Great Escape at Lakeside. Today we're touring a fantastic experience here. This is a huge, huge house that is all game themed. I've already taken a peek and guess what? I'm super duper excited to show you everything it has to offer. But if you're new, welcome. My name is Alana. I'm gonna give you a tour here. I'm all about travel and cruising and so much more. So consider subscribing if you haven't already and give this video a big thumbs up if you enjoyed the video. Come on, let's go take a tour inside and check it all out. Can you spot all the Monopoly pieces already? They have a great map here too of the entire property where you can see everything that it has to offer because this place is huge. Gorgeous, gorgeous. We'll kick off our shoes and go right on in. <laughs> Right when you walk in. Wow. I don't know how to play chess. <laughs> Foosball, I know how to play though. Look at that, that's super cool. What I really like about this foosball table. It's also a coffee table. It's a coffee table and... It's Valencia's height, so she can even play. Oh my God. You wanna play some foosball? I'll teach you how. <laughs> That's great. The first floor is completely wheelchair accessible. Uh, there's a door over here. Uh, don't mind our sneakers. Yeah, don't mind our sneakers. And then also this double doors open up. So it is like a little patio that you can actually just walk. Completely through. screened in as well. Yes, yes, yes. Don't so, have to worry about those pesky mosquitoes. So completely wheelchair accessible, the first floor. Are you making music? Oh my gosh, this is a bedroom? Yes, and it literally is a dungeon. We don't make the beds in there because when you're in the dungeon, you're in trouble. Oh my gosh. You make like a little inside joke. <laughs> they don't make the bed in the dungeon because if you stay in here, you're in trouble. Dungeons and dragons. Naughty, naughty. How fun. Viva Las Vegas. Oh, you're getting a sneak peek of what's to come here, aren't you? The house always wins. All right, second bedroom. Welcome to Las Vegas, the great escape for Las Vegas. You have your po uh, poker table. Take a look at the bed though. How many circle beds have you seen? Really fitting for a high rise suite, huh? No, no winner, winner, chicken dinner this time. And I mean, the whole restroom is themed with poker. Cowboys walk in. The Royal Flush bathroom. Alana, did you see this? <laughs> Welcome to the Royal Flush. That's funny. Again, you guys, make sure you guys are always looking up how cool the deck of cards. The full bathroom. Step on into the kitchen here. So this kitchen is actually completely stocked with all of your appliances, your plates, your silverware, everything that you would really need for you to cook up a great meal here and spend your time. All you have to do is bring all the snacks and food that you want to eat. So you have that ready for you. I think that's pretty cool how they have uh, 46 drinking glasses, 30 coffee cups. So it lets you know how many there are. So when you, you know. That's helpful. Yeah. I see one potato, two potato, three potato, four up here. Hot potato. <laughs> are, we, are we doing the hot potato <laughs> games right now? 125 of your next Monopoly search. Huh, there's 22 hidden small print color Monopoly properties around the house. See example to the left. Look, pinatas, my favorite. Chiclets, oh my gosh, I haven't had those. I remember when chiclets used to be like 10 cents. <laughs> How many of these games have you guys played before? I, 
I normally try to play this game when I'm, you know, trying to relax a little bit. The family that plays together, oh, I don't know how this uh, this comment went. Depends on your family. I think uh, depending <laughs> on your family might be very competitive. So while I'm in the foyer here, you guys. Uh, it's your backgammon. Your backgammon. Bathroom. All right, guys, so we're gonna check out the first few rooms. It is on the first floor. This is the Scrabble room. How many, okay, I do know that I'm horrible with Scrabble. Alana, how are you with Scrabble? Um, not the best. And what I really think it's interesting how, if you guys look at it, that throughout the throughout the house, you can if you find, uh, solve some different clues, you can win uh, prizes for the next day that you come here, which I think is pretty cool. There's even game boards on the ceiling. Oh, wow! Even the closet does offer you. I got blank space, baby. <laughs> I'm not even gonna ask where that's from. All right, guys, let's go to the first bathroom full bathroom it is a jack and joe bathroom uh, you do have monopoly and it's funny how even the curtains we're walking into the monopoly room wow look at the details So this is the carnival and boardwalk games for any of those that have played carnival games and it, you can definitely feel like the beachy the the water the carnival room we have your tickets get your tickets come on down but you can also see like it's the sand we're out on the beach here and there's trespassing trolls these trolls don't have permission to be at the great escape Stand on the opposite side of the bed and throw the bean bags at him. Knock down three in a row and you win bragging rights. Should I give it a go? Let's give it a go. Take a look at Tip a Troll. This is the first game that we're actually getting to play. And you guys, for trivia, you guys know how competitive some of us <laughs> are. Ready, set, go. Oh! That was a lot of if you missed it. Oh. It is pretty cool that you don't need to worry about if the trolls are going to fall out. Um, it is actually bolted down, not bolted down, but it is in the hinges, so it does not come out, so you don't need to worry about falling down. Transpassing poles. Transpassing trolls. <laughs> and you do have one restroom here. It a is a giant walk-in shower and a soaking tub. How grand is that? And even with the, the bowls, fish bowls. Oh my gosh. So you can be taking a shower. I just, I'm gonna have to use this restroom, you guys. It has potty toss. <laughs> oh my gosh, that's too much. So how many of you guys have gone to a carnival and done the Zoltar? Uh, by the way, everything is included here, all the games. Uh, the winning is the bragging rights, but you can turn on Zoltar you can actually turn on Zoltar and he will talk to you. Let's see if he will talk. Oh gosh. Check this out. His eyes will move with us. Oh, wow. Hey, you got the popcorn ready? <gasps> they do have popcorn. The walls to the ceiling, to the floor, everything is incredible. So with it being Jumanji themed, we see the characters on the wall awesome plush couches, chairs to recline in. But take a look at the ceiling. It's full of a jungle here, comes wow. to life. Now on to the big hallway here. The big hallway. Jumanji, War Games. Um, what else? Gamer, which was a very cool. Reindeer Games. 
clue. Again, and this door is the garage. You do get a full laundry room with, uh, with towels and everything. It is fully equipped. The mouse trap. How many different mouses are they gonna be catching here? I think this might be my favorite room here. What is the room theme? This room is Clue. Welcome to the Clue Me In room. So this room here is actually an escape room. So you can play your own escape room. If you've ever been to one before, it's pretty much like it where you can get locked in and you have to solve all the puzzles to find your way out, which I think is really incredible. You do have a bathroom for yourself, so is it really a bad thing that you're getting locked in? Uh, so continue with the game theme. The kid, leave the kiddos here and say you only get to go to the movie room when you figure out how to escape. Let's see what our message is here. We didn't have a clue what to put in here. Ooh. We'll head on upstairs and of course, keeping with the theme, every inch is decorated see Mario up here and Mario here as well Donkey Kong. Donkey Kong so much to look at Wow it's Super Mario World for and did you get Donkey Kong and the princess up there and Mario trying to go save the princess oh I missed that good call Raphael keeps reminding us to make sure we are looking up and down and all around because there's so much to see. Wow, who wants to be a millionaire? I used to watch that show a lot as a kid. So Can you see my creation? Can you figure it out? It says AZ, my initials. Pretty cool, huh? Or travel the world A to Z. <laughs> come make a deal with me. Let's check out this next room here. Let's all right, you guys, the theme action. of the is drawing games. So these are all games that you have to draw. Here, in case you have any plumbing problems, find yourself an Etch-a-Sketch and draw while you're uh, enjoying your bath or perhaps the toilet. <laughs> in the closet, you do have all the answers right here. And you guys, play tic-tac-toe with, with actual tic-tacs. How fun is that? I'll play you real quick. Here we go. Your turn. <laughs> we are gonna take a look out door really quick. You do have a lazy river for those that want to just relax. And the water slide. What I enjoyed with the second, the bedrooms upstairs that we haven't taken a look yet. They are enclosed, so it, it's great if you want to keep the door open and get some fresh air, along with keeping mosquitoes out. What do you think of the outside? Oh my gosh, there's a lazy river. And a water slide. Wow, this is beautiful. 
waterfall. Touch the water. Twinkle lights around uh, the pool too, so at night. Oh, that's nice. The human bowling right now, it is deflated. There is a button that you press and it will inflate right away. So you don't need to worry about uh, anything like that. But how about some human soccer as well? Oh, definitely got to try that in a second. Or, or human foosball. That is human foosball. Human, fo human foosball. So we have human bowling, human foosball, and human billiard. Or is oh. it really human or is it just giant? <laughs> I don't know, some of them. <laughs> well, it does say human, okay. There are kayak options. Uh, they do have pedal boarding, kayaking, uh, a lot of different options, but just be careful, please, because there are alligators in the back here. But I mean, this is pretty relaxing just to, you know, come out here if you have an opportunity. Yes, you roll, you run, run inside the ball. Oh my gosh. I didn't realize what I was doing. <laughs> I know, you're gonna see mommy rolling. Rolling, rolling. Now you roll, Alana. Hi friends. And welcome back to another episode, Alana Rolling. Ready? Ready. Now she's stuck. Hey guys, how long are we stuck here for? Don't worry, we'll hyperlapse this experience of her falling. <laughs> and since we're not getting any edits done for the basketball hoop. <laughs> Sorry guys, I'm gonna do, should I go the lazy way or the, you ready? You guys, what a workout. Woo. You guys, we had to turn off the lights for this one. It is the laser room. This one reminds me of the movie with Sean Connery and Catherine Zeta-Jones. You guys, entrapment, I believe it's entrapment. So it is a room, but it is a laser room. And if you guys can see, I don't know how well that it's gonna zoom. And let's break through the lights. Eh? Okay, I failed, you guys, miserably. Don't touch the laser. Mm. Wow, this is hard. <laughs> I gotta get to the red light, right? Your red light. Okay. How do uh, we do? 128 seconds. My turn, my turn. <laughs> okay, okay. Talk okay, ready? ready? Set, go. Oh, what? That's cheating. <laughs> cheater, cheater, pumpkin eater. <laughs> so here are the rules. You basically will put on the fog machine, hit the lights so that it's the black lights, and then all the laser beams will come through and you have to find your way to either just move your way through the lasers or you could play with laser tag and there's actual your laser guns here. Those are our friends. Oh, never mind. <laughs> <laughs> but you can pretend and play using your Nerf guns. Check this out. This is how incredible it is to keep with the theming. They've covered the window. 
but there are little hooks here in case you did want some light to come in if it was too dark for you. So here is the, the uh, war game room. Again. The war game room. Come on in. I like this room because it has a lot of maps because of course with war you need to know where you're going. So there's lots of maps here. Camo and army green all over. Take a look at the door here. Enter at your own risk. Haha, <laughs> get it? The game of risk. And up here, you do have six different rooms to pick from, along with karaoke, the games, game show studio. That, I mean, this is fantastic that you guys can can do that along with karaoke. You can be the host of your own party. You can do trivia's. I might have to come back. We might have to come back over here and do trivia's here. Are you ready for a marshmallow or to roast a hot dog? It's marshmallow madness. Do you got your head in the game? This was so much fun. All the games, all the different rooms. The theming was incredible. I hope you guys enjoyed checking out The Great Escape at Lakeside. This is a beautiful property. I hope you guys enjoy it. Check out the link down below so you can see even more of the house and learn about the availability for you to come stay at this gorgeous property. Thanks so much for watching. Check out these other two videos that you might enjoy as well. Until next time, ciao for now.